Dear friends, welcome to my channel Understanding RSGS and Geography. This video will be very helpful for you. This video will be very informative and easy to understand. So see this video up to the end. So this video is about how to upload, how to add TIFF file in RStudio. You can see this is the interface of RStudio okay and first of all to add any tip file you need to call several things and before that i want to say that in this video you will understand how to add tip file how to stack tip files and how to know or how to check the number of layer means how many tip files you added that will be understand in this video and of course how to make a mean of stacking different tape files so please like this video because this video will be very helpful to you and see this video up to the end so first of all you need to call several package first first package you need to call is raster package you need to write library raster and run yes I have that library if you are new in this in this channel then please see previous videos regarding our studio that will be very helpful for you and now and to call package called R G D A L and then run. Okay, these two packages will be very important for this. And now I want to upload or I want to add tip files of LST Modis LST. So I am naming here LST files. and now equal to list dot files and within the parenthesis you need to write the path path equal to and now you need to so this is the path click on here copy and right here paste here okay and you need to change little thing like this the slash sign will be changed okay this is done and you need to do this uh, within this okay and you can specify the file so that you need to write comma and then write pattern T T E R N pattern okay and you need to write you need to again inverted comma and you need to select the pattern uh, here several data are available i want to these are the modis data modis 061 oh, yeah modis 061 mod 21 a1d and this is the for uh, these dates means uh, 4th june 2022 and 5th june 2022 this data so you can select that file name up to up to this and copy and now you need to paste here 
yeah this is the pattern and one more thing is comma and right here full dot names yeah and it will be better if true okay and then you need to run this file yeah this file running is completed now you need to print this file because you need, if you want to know is the file is uh, what file is added or not so you need to print what you want to print within this parenthesis you need to write this and you know to run okay this means this data are what yeah printed uh, this all data within this within this name mode is this this all data printed okay and now if you want to stack this file so yeah i need to write here what i am going to do uh, adding adding t files printing stacking and calculating mean okay oh why calculating mean process okay and adding files is done printing is done and now i'll work on stacking stack the files you know layer stack in arcgis this is the same thing and for that you need to write the name what you want to stack lst stack and this okay and now you need to write stack stac stack and then within the parenthesis what you want to stack ah uh, yeah copy and paste and you need to run this yeah stacking is done and now i want to check the stacking and checking the stack layer stacked layer yeah i have to check the stacked layer mm, what i write yeah check the number of layer the number of layer here you can see the seven layer is stacked but when you stack more more layer then you need to check the number and for that you need to write what write the function in layers yeah in layers and you need to select what layers you want to check yeah lst stack and run yeah see that seven layers are stacked and now if you want to make or want to calculate compute the mean of the stacked layer okay for that reason you need to write mean mean uh, dot lst what i'm adding you can name as your wish there is no hard rule on this and you need to write the function called calc oh yeah yes right and then what you want to calculate you need to select that and i'm selecting 
and one important thing is you need to write mean yeah this is the function and now run this yeah means see that stop sign it is uh, signaling that your your um, stack file your mean computation is a ongoing process and i want to request you please subscribe this channel because this channel will be very helpful for you and you know in this channel i am working on uh, making videos regarding google earth earth gis basically for geospatial analysis and i think this video will be very helpful for you so please subscribe this channel and help me to grow this channel and uh, help me uh, for completing my purpose of doing such kind of videos and i want to request you please share this video among your friends and of course comment me if you have any query regarding this okay and one thing i want to say that uh, you can you can uh, run this single uh, lines but at the same time you can run by uh, selecting all files and click on run i'm not clicking on run because this is uh, working and thanks for watching this video and i will show you how to plot uh, these files yeah, it is working i'm writing the function of plotting function plot what mean lst and to plot this i want to run but uh, after completing this i want to run okay and see that now the mean calculation is completed and now i want to plot this and for that click on run yeah it is working after completed uh, we'll see the plot here in the here uh, see that that is plotted okay this is my sub file and it is plotted and the legend is here okay you can change different things i'll show how to change different things in the um, uh, plot uh what i say yeah uh, you can change different things here and in the next video i'll show that so please subscribe this channel and share among your friends and thank you so much